Hey guys, today we're actually looking at um, a MacBook Pro uh, 2015, and I'm going to show you how to do uh, an easy battery removal, uh, especially compared to other methods that I've been seeing. Uh, this one would be very good. But before we get into it, if you could please just leave a, if you could please just drop a like and um, please give us a little comment, maybe even hit that subscribe button right there. That'd be perfect. And uh, we do have uh, more videos coming, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Um, we're gonna do a little bit more teardowns, more. We're gonna do a little bit more. Um, course hardware repairs and software repairs so yep and anything else just let us know what we want but anyways uh, let's get into it so this is the the 1398 uh, MacBook Pro and this is a 2015 this is a 2015 version um, so let me just show you so let's just take off the back real quick of course you need that same screwdriver Okay. Once you remove the cover, guys, always remember to take out the battery. It's the most important thing, the battery connection. And before you do anything on any computer, any laptop, anything electrical in general, just take out the battery right there. The lighting. All right, so once you get that done, um, you do want to take out the connection here. Looks like it's connected. Okay. So the, so the next thing after you take out that, um, there's a, there's two little screws right here. Actually, I think that was fine. All right. So so once you take this out, um, you do want to be careful about this bottom piece here. Um, there's lots of little connections and actually there's a plate that goes underneath the battery right here that we do need to take up so let's do the battery first if you want to give yourself a little bit more leverage you can not actually take out the speakers um, it would make it a lot easier actually so you can give a better grip alright so the next step um, we're just gonna pretty much take out the battery now um, I'll show you the little trick to do um, it makes it quite a bit easier actually So we're actually going to be using this, and no, it's not actually perfume or any spray or anything. We actually put um, alcohol in it. So we're actually going to be using alcohol, and that's going to help remove the adhesive at the bottom here. And once you do that, it's going to make it much easier to pull because you can feel it right now. There's no way you can use your brute force and just get it off. Um, you would pretty much be scraping the whole bottom, which isn't too bad. I mean, you can do that, but you, can, you would pretty much ruin it, and you can risk, of course, other things. But that's always a bad habit. Um, so we actually like using the alcohol. So we're going to be spraying it. We're actually going to be lifting it up like this. And we're just going to be spraying. So we're, we want to go this direction. So when it drips, it's actually going to go down here and try to get the other adhesive that we're missing as well. Um, so we're going to start on this side. So let's just use a little bit of alcohol. Just like that. You can spray it in the little crevices. Um, you want it to sit anyway. So, And alcohol doesn't really harm uh, electronics. Uh, try to get the highest you can. Um, Definitely, we, we have 90% here. Try to get 99 if you can, it would be a little bit better and more safer. Um, so we're just going to be spraying the whole thing here. And as we spray, um, we're just going to kind of go because it will loosen as we actually even talk right now. It is getting better at the moment. So this this is a really good wedge tool um, we like to use. It's pretty stiff. Um, it's definitely just, you really just need a wedge tool so you can get down here and then try to remove each part of it. Um, if you ever struggle at any point, um, definitely just keep using more, and it will make it much easier for yourself. You'll feel it, actually. So try to get a good feel for it. You can kind of hear it rip a little bit. You can hear the adhesive coming unstuck a little bit. That's always a good news. If you do, if it's still a little bit of a struggle, you can put a little bit more alcohol. Um, in this case, for what you're doing here, 
see you can hear it now how it comes up pops a little bit and that's not anything at the bottom you don't have to worry there's just there's a big play at the bottom but we are just going to take it up You just go really slow, you just get a feel, you can kind of, you can hear it, it's tearing off, yeah, it's coming very nicely. And you can see right, right there, see, not that much effort there. Um, once that's in, you can kind of get this one out of the way. Um, just kind of keep spraying as you go. Uh, the more the better, honestly, the more alcohol you get, the better in there. So... Why they choose to adhesive this uh, is a little bit beyond me, but I guess you're not really going to remove it most of the time anyway. But if you ever did need to remove the battery, this is what you need to do. Or at least it's the easiest way, I believe, um, to do it. Okay, now this you can actually bend this a little bit more, which is good. So now all we need to do is remove the last two. And of course, be very careful. Um, there is a plate underneath, which is fine. So you're a little bit protected, but still, just be very careful. Just take some patience, but I th do really think this is a great way. All right, and once you get the last piece, just be very careful when you pull it up. Of course, be mindful of that cable and the board and anything else, of course. So let's just, I'm gonna put it flat actually so it doesn't pull. Just like this thing 
It does just look like though it's just the um, the adhesive is still hanging on a little bit. So no one pull completely up all the way because there is a plate there, of course. Um, so that's it, and it's gonna kind of, and it's gonna kind of look like this. And it's going to kind of look like this. It's done. It's a little bit wet. Of course, it's alcohol, so it's okay. Um, and here is the bottom plate there. But yeah, that's how you remove it. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please uh, comment um, below just anything, any questions you have or any other videos that you want us to do. Uh, please hit that subscribe button. It really does help us. We appreciate it. Um, yep, and uh, give us a like as well. Maybe share with your friends or something. And um, yep, you guys have a good one. Bye.